Who's the man on the cover of Alice in Chains' 1990 debut record facelift? The group would work with photographer and video director Rocky Schenk. Some of the concepts the musicians had for the album cover had the members emerging from an eyeball. Next, Alice in Chains would use a swimming pool wrapped with plastic with the members swimming to the surface. The shoot didn't go according to plan, but a picture of Lane wrapped in plastic would be used for the artwork for the single We Die Young. They moved on to the next idea. Shank would recall messing around with in-camera multiple exposures where he could create a distorted image for years. The members would go through Shank's portfolio and saw what he described as I quote, black and white portraits of haunted, distorted faces. Alice asked Shank to replicate the technique so he did it using color photos of the band members' faces. The idea was to use all four faces superimposed to make one expression. The one that was ultimately chosen was bassist Mike Starr's face. Upon seeing the photo of Mike Starr, members of the group called the album Facelift.